Every time the New York Yankees take the field, they're playing in the shadow of greatness. Lou Gehrig was one of the most legendary players ever to wear the interlocking NY. And 80 years to the day after his untimely death to ALS, Major League Baseball celebrates his legacy with the first ever Lou Gehrig Day. Everybody, great to have you with us on the DraftKings Yankees pregame. Bob Lorenz and Jack Curry with you. Game three of four between the Yankees and Rays. Yanks come off a dramatic win. They're trying to build on that, but in a way, baseball is secondary, the actual game, to what the day is itself. It is, Bob, and we are here to cover the game, and we'll have the scores and the results, and the Yankees are hoping for another exciting finish, but when you talk about Lou Gehrig and his legacy and the fact that he finally gets his day, I think this is long overdue to recognize Lou Gehrig and what he meant to Major League Baseball. You think about who he was on the field, you think of durability and success, but you think of how he lived his life, you think of courage and strength. So now he joins Jackie Robinson as Roberto and Roberto Clemente as the only through players who have a day dedicated to them. You mentioned that he died 80 years ago. That, in part, is why this day was chosen. June 2nd is also the day that he cemented his status as the Yankees' starting first baseman, went on to play 2,130 games. So his legacy is strong. The Yankees will honor him today, Bob, but they will also honor families who have been impacted by ALS. Oh, 